All right, so now that Field showed us exactly what to do, we're ready to screw it all up and probably not. Oh, yeah, we're not taking advice. any of that we're advice, do our right? best right now. Top five ride or die players that uh, we got to have this year. Fitz, who Ooh, you I get to go first? You're going first. I, I feel good about I'm this. I'm the guest. I'm following your lead. I feel strong about this, and I'm just going to scroll, and I'm going to scroll, and I'm going to scroll. Why could you be looking? The for? alphabet is good to me, and I am going to take at number one on this entire thing. One, Darren Waller. Now, look, I know Field says you don't need to get yourself a tight end early. I understand that completely. But understand this, John Gruden's offense, mm, he's not using him like a tight end. He is a wide receiver. The Raiders don't have a prominent wide receiver. They know will step into the role to get the catches that are going to come. You're talking about a top 10 scoring offense last year. You're talking about, I believe, by the end of the year, probably the number two tight end in the entire NFL. He's my ride or die. That was maybe like number three on his list of do not do. So I appreciate yeah. the fact yeah. that you went ahead. Oh, no, and went the other way. Can Don't you tell me what to me do. That feel. Way? Can we slide oh, yeah. it? Oh, I'll slide I'm you. just sliding the you. people because you seem to be a better slider. Oh. What I'm going to do is we talked about homerism at the beginning, right? Mm -hmm. And like picking with your head and your heart. I'm kind of doing the opposite of that because the reason I'm going Jamar Chase here isn't because I'm an LSU fan. Uh -huh. It's not because of anything with his ties now. It's because I was standing on the sidelines of that ni national championship game in 2019, and I saw him go off for, what, 221 receiving yards. He had two touchdowns. And guess what? He's going to be linking up with the same guy this year, Fitz, Joe Burrow. So how can you not pick Jamar Chase? I think he's going to have a monster year. And because he hurt my heart in that game, because I was there covering Clemson, I, I believe in what he's going to do at the next level, too. Now that you have opened up that hurt, it makes it easy for me to do this then because if we're talking rider dies that I think are going to have Let's a huge go. year. I was at that same game, and I will never forget standing there with all of our different analysts that I think are so brilliant and asking, hey, why are we not talking about this guy the way we talked about Andrew Luck? I know it was only one season, but when you watched what Burrow did on the sidelines, it was incredible. Now, if you watched last year, Zach Taylor, coach of the Bengals, seemed like he absolutely didn't care about getting Joe Bur Burrow murdered every time he dropped back. That line, atrocious. But they get him a huge weapon in Jamar Chase. Joe Burrow is, even if he's not uh, healthy right at the beginning of the year, 100% of who he could be, he will be by the end of the season in a 17-game uh, season. I think Burrow's going to go off and have a lights-out year. So I'll put him at number three. College football playoff record for receiving yards with those two together. <laughs> so we'll just imagine what they're going to do at the next level. Um, you know, Joe Burrow would love to have a really long career like a quarterback that is now in Tampa. Tampa Bay, and I'm going to go to Tampa Bay, and I'm going to uh, get Mr. Chris Godwin. Because, look, I know you're thinking, okay, you're just like, what, they won the Super Bowl last year, you're just going to go all in on them. Maybe you're thinking Mike Evans. Maybe you're thinking another guy, A.B. You're probably thinking Gronk, Gronk, but Chris Godwin had himself a great year last year, was actually targeted more than Mike Evans in their four playoff games last year. So, Fitz, could we see them building on that momentum? Are we going to see another championship run? My sister lives down in Tampa. I would love to see her get another Super Bowl for her sake. Why not? Look, your sister, I'm sure, is wonderful. Tom Brady, you've had enough. Just stop. Just stop. I don't no, want Tom Brady to win anymore. Okay, I'm going to find my fifth place. I'm just scroll there. Wait, wait, wait. Am I going the wrong way? Am I going the wrong way? Oh, Am I going, going the wrong way? What are oh, we yeah. doing? Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Here we go. Woo! If there's one thing I know, it's, it's not a homer pick. Uh, no, oh, no, this is complete. Let me be clear. This is a homer pick. And it's because, frankly, I put too much of my life's joy in how my beloved Raiders play every single Sunday. I need Derek Carr to be ride or die. I need Derek Carr to be great. I need Derek Carr to be spectacular because Vegas is opened up for the people, for the masses. And frankly, for my own mental health, Carr, if he goes off this year, the Raiders need that to even be competitive. I think he will go off. Again, top 10 scoring offense last year, and look at the receivers he was throwing to. I don't believe it was Nelson Aguilar that made Carr great. I think it was vice versa. Carr this year has a bang up year, puts him in number five on I my I felt record. pretty good about totally our good. list and what we were picking until you started going for what you needed and not what you believed and not what we've seen and not what we were projecting. If there's any fact I know, it's that if you say anything wrong about Derek Carr on Twitter, he blocks you. And I don't want to be blocked by my favorite well, team's quarterback. I love you. There you go. Now, uh, tweet that out. Maybe the I love you will get us extra. Might give me a creepy block. I don't know. No, no. Yeah. It'll get us bonus points with him for sure. Uh, a fun year this year, Fitz, because we don't just get 16 weeks. We get 17 weeks of football. And we're going to take a look now at some of the new things coming up this year, 2021. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.
Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.